Hello and welcome to this presentation. My name is Lee Snyder, the product manager for the still segment here at Trimble. And today I want to show some of the user interface changes that we've made in Tecla Structures version 2018i. So the first one that I want to focus on, let's go up here to File, down to Settings. You'll notice a few things that are different in here. You'll notice that we've added in this new Toolbars section. So if you want to toggle on or off any of your toolbars, you have the ability to do that directly through this File, Settings option. Before, you could also come up here into the Quick Launch and just type in Toolbar. And then you could see these options would show up here and you could just go through and toggle those on or off depending upon your preference. Another thing that you'll notice that we've also added here is this User Interface Toolbar slider. So before we had the large icon option that you could set on with your toolbars. So now if you just go ahead and click through this, you can set your toolbars to be the various sizes depending upon your screen resolution and your personal preference. So real easy just to slide through those different options. The other thing that we've also added to all of our toolbars are these hide switches. So you'll notice the icon at the end of these. So if you go ahead and click on that, you can then real quickly just choose the toolbar icons that you want to be able to see there within the model as you're working. Same idea over here if we want to go in and turn on or off some of these that we don't use frequently. Say for example, I want to turn off all my rebar buttons, then I could do that there. You'll notice also though, as these are active, it's going to remember those whether they're hidden or not. So for example, here I have my bolts, which is available for me to select. If I go ahead and hide that, and I come back into the model and window over this, you'll see that I'm able to still select the bolt groups here, as you can see. So just because it's hidden here doesn't mean that it's necessarily turned off, but it will remember your settings. So if you want to hide something, go ahead and just make it visible, deselect it, and then now when you hide that there, you won't be able to select those options there. As you can see, if I come in and try and grab these bolt groups, I'm not able to. So the last thing that I want to show is something that we've added to the contextual toolbar. So for clarity, let me just go ahead and isolate one of these assemblies here. As you come in and select an individual member, you'll notice that we've added this new view angle option to the contextual toolbar. So real quick, if I just want to go in and see a top view of that member, I can just toggle through these. So if I want to see back view, left view, right view, front view, or bottom view, then I have the ability just to real quickly toggle through those as needed. So a real nice and easy way just to alter the view directly from the contextual toolbar as opposed to other options that you had previously. So there's a quick overview of some of the user interface changes that we've made in Tecla Structures version 2018i. We invite you to try these out, send us any feedback that you may have, and we hope you enjoy this new development.